Hello, this is a let's play of Anachronox, another one of my favorite games. Uh, I think it's the third RPG I ever played. Uh, it's a Western RPG, uh, but it has a lot of JRPG influences, uh, especially gameplay wise and things like that. Um, It is quite old, as you can tell by the graphics and all, but I think the story and the humor in the game more than make up for that uh, slight flaw. Uh, this is the menu screen, as you can see, you can just pick a difficulty. Um, I won't be talking too much through cutscenes, uh, especially not if there's any talking, because I don't want to ruin them. Um, let me check if my options are uh, correct. Uh, I'm going to set subtitles on, because I always do. Uh, <laughs> this is the high-res version of the game, actually. Um, and we have the fancy menu graphics. I'll leave the audio like this for now. Uh, yeah, let's get started. So, I'll play it on normal. Uh, I played it a couple of times. Normal seems alright. I really love this uh, opening cutscene, it sets a great atmosphere in my opinion. This is one game I would like to play in 3D actually. <laughs> As you can see, this is a tiny planet of Anachronox, and uh, yeah, it has some oddities. I think it's a great concept. So, we're in a bar, being beaten up. By a midget. Money boots, or next time I mix and match. Hit me. 
Hasn't there been enough of that? Have a heart. You want to dead us, kids? Anyone else throwing me out of windows lately? Come clean with the dead, Sly. Dead is no slouch, and he's got muscle. He'll collect one way or the other. Hey, money's tight. As soon as it rains... I'll pour some. I'd suggest a job if I thought you'd take it. Try me. The key to my cellar's missing. Oh, uh, yeah? Where's the job part come in? When you find it, and I pay you. Man, I need a real case. I need a challenge worthy of my deductive and pugilistic skills. <laughs> but I've got a bouncer. Cute. You want some real advice? Find a job. It's amazing how many of your problems it'll solve. You think? Fatima! Anything on sender net? Nothing you're sober enough for. I'm just waiting for business to pick up. What's with the attitude? For one, I'm sick of being dead. And second, I'm tired of watching you drink your life away. When did you become such a bum? I'm not a bum. Prove it. Bums don't have offices. An office isn't a storage room in a cheap bar, Boots. Hey. <laughs> It's time for a new line of work. Forget it, sweetheart. I'm a detective. It's what I do. Then go out and do it. I'm always here if you ever get off your butt and make useful. So there we go. You can now take control. Press F1 to use uh, Fatima with a digital lady and this is our quest log basically so find a job kiddo do this stuff because i ain't letting you leave rowdies without a clue get the camera find some money try the back room maybe use the time minder over there for luck and find yourself a job lead so it also gives you some more information of the places where you are so it describes you what an Acronox really is. Uh, long dead alien city planet in the shell of Sender 1. So the opening cutscene, you could see um, this large globe with spikes coming out and spaceships uh, transferring in and out of it. That is Sender 1. And uh, when, when we follow the spaceship inside, you could see the smaller planet of Anachronox in the middle of it and that is where we currently are uh, so nobody really knows why it was left uh, empty Anachronox means poison from the past or poison remaining from a previous time so Anachronox South is the bricks Anachronox Tours, where shuttles and quarter caps fly between Anachronox and send the station. The Bricks, nickname for South Anachronox. <laughs> also how people that don't agree with that seem to fall off great heights from these gigantic tumble bricks onto the much smaller ones below. The Canadian dollar, due to a freak galac of galactic commerce, this has become the standard unit of currency for the galaxy. Some areas still use non-digital money. The one dollar coin is called a loony because it has a loon on the back. Gives you some information on other, other areas too. So here there's Fatima. Uh, I was Boots' personal secretary for a long time, then I died. And you 
to be cruel, let me digitize so I could serve you in the afterlife. Thanks. Oh, and yes, you've been mispronouncing my name for years. Life cursor. So that is our actual cursor is a. Uh, is called a life cursor and is actually an item in the game world. Uh, it's a flying personal digital assistant. And we've got Fatima operating ours. Or inside, it's a bit difficult to tell. So a sender. So we're Anachronix is in sender one. So it explains here that. Uh, spheres with spikes and they send out radio signals that can transfer you to somewhere else in the galaxy so it's a fast way of traveling sender one was the biggest sender humankind knows of outside the sender station i think we quick briefly saw that also in the opening sequence right that's it for the backstory for now um, as i said it's one of my favorite games i picked it up um, uh, from a bargain bin actually just reading the back text it seemed interesting uh, assemble a team visit planets <laughs> so this this is where we can find our uh, party members, of course, there's only one at the moment, and our inventory, and our stats. I honestly never pay too much attention to these, because like in JRPGs, these are updated automatically, so there's no point spending or anything. Uh, and then exit. So let's see. To our office upstairs. Private Detective Sly Boots, what's your problem? <laughs> Very welcoming. Let's see, that's the window we were tossed out of. That's the time minder, that little animal. my camera okay so how does it work arrow keys uh, delete photo take photo okay press f11 to use the camera mm. so i can zoom in and out i can swap between photo slots here and Space is actually taking a picture. Picture one. And delete. Right. What's this? My old broadband scanner from when I lived on Cordica. Nothing interesting on the Noxguard band. The Noxguard patrolling the landing platform who got issued the wrong size helmet. Riveting. And what's this? Trash. Did you do boots? No. One of my favorite characters. Pal 18's been out of commission all year. Size B batteries needed. <laughs> Bet Cordicom never thought someone could trick out their toys with data port accessories and battle claws. Probably not. I miss you, little hot rod. <laughs> right, moving along. Uh, you can tell if, if uh, things have more than one dialogue option because the camera does not pan away from the character you're clicking on. So here's a nice uh, photo of the good old days. You can see Pal with his batteries in and Fatima 
some other lady and boots wearing a snazzy outfit. Lost the key to the back room a long time ago, but I bet I can pick the lock. So every character has a special skill and Boots' special skill is lock picking. So you hold down control. So you guess the code for each tumbler by clicking up and down arrows above each digit or by using up and down arrow keys. Then click on the tumbler or space to try that number. So you got 60 seconds to solve easy locks like this. Let's try it. And a meter will help you show how close you are. So that means so okay. enough what have you got here cash I think <laughs> yeah found some dough uh, my old ape arcade machine I had to sell all the cartridges I suck <laughs> yes you do and this is a chest that seems interesting but I don't think we can open it yet so this is a master pick lock my skill is not high enough to pick this uh, it works pretty much the same way but I'll have to upgrade my skill before I'll be able to actually do this as you could tell five tumblers ten seconds that's never going to work Obviously, so we'll have to come back once our skill is upgraded. Um, as I said, every character has a special skill they can do and you can get upgrades for all of the skills. Um, there are, the storyline is, is very linear, um, but there's a, quite a bit of exploration you can do in the game and collections you can uh, start or finish. Um, I'll try to do most of them, but I can't guarantee because some of them are really annoying to get to. Um, so we'll see what happens. But I'll definitely play through the storyline. I'll also be saving um, regularly because last time I played this the game was a bit unstable and crashed a couple of times and I don't want to lose too much uh, of my game play um, I think we could talk to everybody let's talk to these people Madam and Nonic Nox guards raided the compounds of the top three crime lords in the bricks last night guess that has got the house to himself now <laughs> so that is sort of like the crime boss of uh, of this area and we've got uh, these people seem to be plotting something the resistors could use you too bad you're you so there's a resistance going against Detta he seems to have the Nox guards in his pockets Uh, plotting something against three current crime lords. Hey Boots, there's glass in your hair. Well, yeah. No, it's all the rage on Cortica. All the elements are falling into place. In a few weeks we'll hit Detta's fortress. So she's part of the uh, Rebel Alliance. I'll ask you to join if I thought you'd say yes. Yerokan's disappeared and he's got the blueprints. Where is that boy? Hmm. Who's this? It's like a 
a miner of some sort. I'm nervous, like brass tinkle. To excavate mistake. Problem is, everybody's coming out of there minus their limbs. So he's a miner. I don't want to fight cave monsters, and I certainly don't want to work for Ditter. But the man's got to eat, right? Right. Very true. <laughs> That's unfortunate. That looks like the bouncer uh, Rowdy was telling us about. Yeah, Doyle the bouncer. I heard falls early this year. Yeah. You're hilarious. <laughs> Keep laughing, dude. He's tall. Why is he so tall? Let's play a little game. There's several mini games uh, throughout the entire universe that you can play. Uh, I used to be so great at this and I completely forgot what the trick is. Finally. Okay. Who are you? Pain paradox. What a wonderful. Yeah, it was painful. What? It's weird. Buy me a drink and I'll tell you the secret to successful fighting. Buy like the cheapest drink possible. Thank you. I didn't think you would actually buy it. Yeah, probably a scam. Secret to successful fighting is learning at chops at Whack Master Jack's Temple of Beating. Oh, we should probably go there then. Trust me. Yeah. I will. Hey. Big loud brew. Hi lady. Do I know you? Oops. Valesta. <laughs> Caught your swan dive earlier. Pretty sweet, dude. Mm. Been practicing all week. Uh 
ha a job lead my friend the animals been exploring the tunnels for some guy maybe they need an extra hand she's slumming at frank's flop house if you're interested <laughs> so we've got a first clue uh, there's a Dianamo in Frank's flop house. Some guy hired her for a job. Maybe they need another hand. Maybe they do. Is this dude being so sad about? Man oh man, Sly. I gambled away all my money at Casinox again. All I've got left is this slag of mystic I found. What do you think? Should I sell this junk or what? Mystic. Well, this, uh, this data guy seems to be sending people to their death in tunnels to collect it, so hold on to it. Could be worth something someday. Yeah, what am I thinking? Thanks for the advice, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thanks. Thanks for reminding me. So, these are the time minders, and... In universe, you pet them, and they uh, keep you in their memory. They exist out of time or something odd like that. 